Hi, my name's Dave Cat. How's it going? 2017, hey. Every time a year goes past, I always wonder where the hell the time has gone and how fast time goes these days. I think I'm getting to an age now where I've started to realize what all the people were saying all those years ago, like, these are the best times of your life. Oh, time starts to go a lot faster from now on. And back then, of course, I was just like, yeah, whatever. I'm a kid. Woo! But now... <sighs> So for a lot of people, 2016 was a pretty shitty year. And to be honest, quite a lot of shitty things happened to the world. But for me, it wasn't so bad on a purely selfish level. <laughs> so let's have a little recap of Dave Cad's 2016. So first of all, 2016 kind of saw the explosion of my YouTube channel. I've been doing this now for over five years and always just kind of ticked along made videos, never really expected much until last year when I really found my people. I started talking about my experiences in Finland and things like that and a lot of Finnish people came and it's probably one of the best things that happened to me in 2016. My subscriber count just rocketed in like six months or so and then of course I went to Finland for the summer which is just uh, another completely crazy story and the summer in Finland kind of happened slap bang in the middle of this surge in my YouTube channel. And that was pretty perfect timing because that meant I could go to Finland and then I got to meet a bunch of the people that watch my videos. And of course, last year I got to go to TubeCon whilst I was in Finland, which I have to say was, I was about to say probably, but no, definitely the craziest day of my life. Not only going into a place where tons of people knew who the hell I was, but also being the first person in my family to be on TV. Wow, all right, so, Without further ado, the winner is the legendary Dude That was pretty sick. After the summer, I came back down to planet Earth and then I got myself a new job. For all of 2015 and up until the summer of last year, I was self-employed and that kind of fizzled out for uh, certain reasons. As soon as I came back from the summer, I pretty much found a job straight away and it was in social media and it was pretty much perfect. In November, I was lucky enough to be selected for the YouTube Next Up program. I was invited over to the YouTube space in London where I learned all about YouTube and how to make awesome content. Also got to hang out with some really amazing people for a whole week. I also made this video here with Felix Zenga, a Finnish beatboxer. Maybe one day it will see the light of day. But to close off the year, Kat's family actually invited me to Africa with them. I actually only got back from that trip a few days ago and I have a ton of footage to edit and show you guys. So watch out for that coming soon. And that pretty much takes us to now, 2017. So Dave, what's in store for you this year? Good question, you handsome devil. This year is just gonna be awesome. It's gonna be the year of the CAD. I'm calling it now. That was weird, I'm sorry. My main goal for 2017 is to make YouTube something that I do every day as my job. That's been my goal for like the last five years and now it's finally kind of in sight. It's almost where you are and I can, I can, I can touch it, but I just can't quite grab it. Hopefully if you guys continue to support me the way that you have uh, over the last like 12 months, it will definitely happen and pretty soon as well. So that's goal number one. So aside from YouTube, some of my other goals, I feel like last year I had so much else going on. I didn't really give enough time to my studying of Swedish language. So by the end of 2017, and I'm saying it here, I really want to be somewhat fluent in Swedish. And speaking of languages, I know I've joked around with learning Finnish uh, in quite a few videos up until now, but I genuinely want to learn a little bit of Finnish. I'd love to know the basics and kind of the rules around this insane language. Now I know learning two languages at the same time probably isn't the smartest idea, but I'd really love to nail the basics of Finnish so that when I go there or when I meet any of you guys in Finland that we could maybe have a few sentences of Finnish uh, exchange between us before I start looking like an idiot. So there we have it guys, I've said it. I wanna learn Finnish in one year. And if the YouTube thing uh, keeps going the way that it does and I am able to make YouTube my job, I'd love to spend another summer in Finland. So although I spend quite a lot of time in Finland, I'd love to travel around some of the other Nordic and Scandinavian countries. I think it's just such a beautiful part of the world, at least from what I've seen so far. I've spent like a couple of hours in Stockholm and a day or so in Tallinn in Estonia, but 
it's not enough. I want to see more. Also, if you get the chance to go to Finland again this summer, I'd like to see a little bit more of Finland. I want to get up north. I want to see Lapland. I want to go say hi to Stana. Anyway. So I guess that was my little wrap up of 2016 and looking forward to 2017. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and maybe share it with a friend. And if you don't have any friends, you can share it with me. I'm your friend. Always. But once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya.